Hey guys, it's Moment7 here, and today I'm bringing you episode 3 of my Manchester United Football Manager 2016 career mode. Now, I apologise that I haven't uploaded this in over a week, but yeah, looking at it, we, we are doing dreadful in the league. Um, let's have a look at the previous results. So, we've had two back-to-back -back losses in the league. Oh no, wait, it was sandwiched in between a 3-0 win against Swansea. So, we've had very hit and miss results. We are in the Champions League group stage, however, so... This episode, we're going to play up into that Manchester City derby, and then um, yeah, we'll leave off. So we've got five games. We've got three, no, four Premier League games. No, one is a Capital One Cup. We'll get this right eventually. One's a Capital One Cup game. Three are Premier League, and then we've got that game against PSV in the Champions League. So the first game is against Southampton. What I'm going to do, I'm going to change up the formation, I think, slightly, and I think I'll play a four like that um, so a 4-2-3-1 and I think I'm gonna look to control actually you know what fuck it we are away but it's the cup it's Southampton so since it's the cup I'm gonna give a few debuts uh, well not debuts but a few chances to some other players so I reckon that will give Memphis a bit of a rest so we'll do that we'll switch the wings up and um, Varela will give him a start and uh, I think Lingard yeah, I think we'll give Ashley Young a bit of a rest as well, but we'll, um, hmm, nah, nah, nah. should we put him on the bench somewhere? Um, I think we should, yeah, we'll put him in for that, and we'll also give Phil Jones a game, so we'll give Smalling, you know what, we'll give Rojo a rest as well, so it, it's quite a different team, this could go completely badly, but it's the Cup, I do like the Cups, uh, I do like doing well in them, but... You know, we've been so poor in the league, so I can't afford to not rest some players. So, let's give the fans the performance they're expecting of us. There wasn't really any team talks there that I particularly wanted to give. But anyway, we'll see what happens. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we can get the right result. Right, come on, Varela. <laughs> oh, shit! What a fucking debut! That wasn't a shot, that was a cross. But what a goal from Varela! Take a bow, he's lobbed, uh, hopefully that's Forster in net, because that means they're playing their best goalkeeper, but what a goal, what a start for Varela. And, yeah, wow, literally two minutes later, this career pisses me off man, like, I hate starting off shit, there's so many other football manager careers I've got that I'm doing so well in, and I just can't find the right formations or anything in this, in this one, it's pissing me off, but hopefully we can improve. Right, come on. It's a good ball through to Wilson. He's passed it down. Come on, Varela, get another cross in. And he's been tackled. So that is a flow with Varela's gameplay, I suppose. And Manny is just seriously like, come on. It's one of these highlights, isn't it? It'll turn out. To, oh, is it? Is it ours? I hate these highlights, honestly. Right, go on. Yes. Got to be a goal there it is. Brilliant work from Jesse Lingard there to find Valencia. Nice finish. 2-1. Come on. Foxy, come on. Where's the marking? Oh. Right, come on. Fellini into Wilson, Valencia, and that should have been a second. I've changed some instructions there. I've told them to hit early crosses, retain possession, and also be a bit more expressive. So, I, sorry, I haven't said retain possession. I probably should have, shouldn't I? Oh, for fuck's sake. 3-2. Oh, oh, for fuck's sake, we've got a free kick. I think that's... That, this is definitely their highlight. This is ridiculous, man. Come on. Oh, oh, maybe it's ours. I sub no, no. I subbed on Young and Martial, trying to get a bit more attacking intent because three, two, you know. Oh my god. Oh my god. I sm I subbed on Smalling to try and improve the defence, and he does that. Fuck's sake, man. Well, we're out the cup. Good start of this episode. 
Right, I'm going to revert back to 424. We're going to play attacking purely because we're at home. And uh, yeah, this is the lineup we've gone with David De Gea, Luke Shaw, Marcus Rojo, Chris Smalling, Matty O'Darmian, Morgan Schneidlin. Daily Blind in the centre mid position. Could be a bit of a risk. I might drop him down to CDM if he performs badly as a centre mid. We've got Young and Memphis on the wings with Martial and Rooney up top. So yeah, let's get a good result. We really need one. We're so far behind fourth. It's a joke. We're out the cuff. And we narrowly got in the Champions League. So it's been a very poor start. But I suppose it can't get too much better. I'm going to assertively tell them that, um, yeah, prove the critics are wrong. All right, a lot of players seem motivated. That's a good sign. Hopefully, we can get a nice resounding win. All right, this is going good build-up play. Come on, Memphis. What, why are you shooting? All oh, right, it's a corner, right? Come on. Oh, Smalling just over. But promising signs early on. a brilliant tackle and that's a brilliant ball and Rooney it's an okay save from Butland right come on I don't think we're getting anything from this corner please not their counter attack seriously someone close them down a good tackle Schneidling get in right come on we've got to make something yes thank fuck for that we finally get a goal get in Rooney 1-0 Right, go on, Martial. I've sped it up because, yeah, if there's a brilliant goal, we can check it on the replay. But, yes, come on. Oh, that should have been 2-0. And now they're on the counter. All right, they're not. Good defending, Smalling. Great, Martial injury. Hurrah. Yay, exactly what I want to see. Right, come on. We need to extend this lead. That's brilliant. Good play. I've just subbed on Matter literally about a minute ago. 2 0. Get in. Rooney with the assist. Matter with the goal. A solid 2 0 win. I'll take that against Stoke. Well done, lads. Keep it up. Moves us up to 8. Right. The home game against PSV. I want a good start in the Champions League. We've got a strong lineup. Same defence, really. Shaw, Rojo, Smalling, Damian. Schneidlin and Carrick in the midfield. A little bit of balance there with Mata on the left this time. I'm, I think he's more effective there. That's where I subbed him on uh, when he scored last game in for uh, Memphis. We put Memphis up top because Martial's injured. Got Rooney and Young. So, yeah, let's again hope we can. Well, we only had one win in a row. But, you know, get some momentum. That would be brilliant. Oh, they've got a chance early on, and it's 1 0, Brumer. <sighs> right, come on. Yes, Rooney. That's brilliant. Quick fire comeback. That's what I like to see. 1 1. Oh, shit. I didn't even know that was going to be part of the highlight, but literally. I went quiet, didn't think anything was coming of that. Good ball from Memphis. Rooney to get a second. Brilliant. Get in. Oh, for fuck's sake. There's no defence there. 2-2. Two, two. Damian on goal. Seriously? Fuck's sake, man. Right. Is, that's a penalty. I don't even know what the hell happened there, but we've got a penalty. Rooney, can he complete his hat-trick? Yes, he can. Three goals. In one game in the Champions League, get in. We've got another chance, and that's Rooney with his fourth four in one half for Wayne Rooney. A lovely ball from Matta. He's doing some serious work on the left there, interlinking with Memphis. Doing very, very well. He's had three assists, and Rooney has had four goals. I'm going to say I'm extremely delighted. I'm not with the defence, but try and keep their spirits up, I suppose. Right, they've got a corner. David De Gea's court. Is this going to be our attack on the counter? I hope so. Matter. He's had a really, really good game. Wilson. He's tried to cross it in. Can he get it in again? It's Matter. He's tackled. Wilson. Too young. 5 2. Get in, lads. This is the attacking fluid football I wanted from the start. Get in. Oh, <laughs> we've gave away another goal. We never make it easy for ourselves. I know the highlights are a bit quick, but that's the way I like them. I like quick fire games. I don't know, it just suits me more. Um, are we going to get another late goal right at the end? It's young. Yes, we are. Matt caps off a wonderful display with the goal. 6 3. Ah, the fans must be delighted with this one. Attacking football throughout. And that's the end. We've won our first Champions League game. 
get in. I'm very, very happy with that. I want to go far in the Champions League. Maybe going out of the Capital One Cup will allow, since we've got such a thin squad, you know, to have a little bit of a break. I don't like going out Cups. I do prefer to win them, but it, it could be positive in the long run. I'll try and win the FA Cup. We'll go for that one, definitely. Memphis has won Young Player of the Month. That's brilliant here. And uh, Wenger gets fucking award for top boss. Brilliant. Apparently my job's secure. Now I'm very surprised by that considering we're eight. I know we're only six points off fourth, but you know, I I've went out the Capital One Cup, haven't been amazing. Right, I've decided to give a few players a rest. I would like to also give Smalling and Rojo a rest, but I can't because I've loaned out a lot of players. There's obviously a few injuries to like blend, etc. It's kind of annoying, but this is the team we're going to go with. Wayne Rooney, I can't drop him because he's just scored four, even though he's on 89 fitness. Hopefully, with uh, when's the next game? I think we've got an international break, so this is why I'm playing him. Um, we've also, you know, got some other players that I've brought in, like Valencia, purely because of fitness. But Mata and Rooney, very important. They had stunning games midweek, so hopefully they can continue that. Uh, apparently Bastian Schweinsteiger is lacking, uh, lacking match experience and that's because he's just came back from an injury. So we're going to tell them to pick off where they left off and hopefully we can get another win. Right, we've got a cross here. Can we get it back in? Matt A into Rooney. That partnership this season has been brilliant. Matt A and Rooney, fantastic. 1-0. Right, come on, can we get another quick fire goal? It's Marouane Fellaini with his first goal of the season. Get in, lad, 2-0 against Bournemouth. This is better. This is a lot better. <sighs> How the fuck did Wilson miss that? Jesus. Oh, shit, Verrellas gave him it back, and Bournemouth should have scored at least, at least one by now. Right, that's a lovely ball. Varela, Schweinsteiger, this is a good play, it's Rooney, but we've lost the ball and now they've got a counter-attack and it's Glenn Murray off the post. Holy shit. Oh, this is a chance right at the end. That's a poor pass and it's Valencia and Burrich has just done enough to save that and I think that's going to be half-time. Right, we've got another cross here and it's Schweinsteiger with his first goal for Manchester United as well. 3-0, another brilliant ball from Mata, Fellini nods it on, so that's an assist for Fellini, I think, and Schweinsteiger is there to volley it home, 3-0, oh, we've got another chance here, I think, have we, um, no, it might be Bournemouth, actually, Wilson, can they finally score, they do deserve it, but, you know, obviously I want to keep a clean sheet, do the best we can, that's brilliant play, to be honest, come on, no, one, no one's getting anywhere near, and... Why was that a highlight? Like, there was nothing there that was highlight worthy. Right, come on, Dormian. I've just subbed him on. Tried to get the cross in, but it's came out. And it's back to Dormian with a cross. And nothing's came of it except a Bournemouth attack, counter attack. And wow, their shooting has been wank today. Could have been 3 3. A solid 3 0 win. Very happy with that. Uh, that's three wins on the bounce for the first time this season. Two in the league, one in the Champions League. And now we're, we're three points off fourth, so we've cut that gap. We've got an international break in a very, very important game against Manchester City next. So we cannot lose that. Right, it's the big game. And for some reason, probably because of the international break and they've been played quite a lot, Rooney and Smalling are not fit, but I can't drop them. This game is too big. It's at Old Trafford. Um, I'm going to change the mentality to control. I don't want to go full force against Manchester City, which is why I've went with kind of a, well, it's a 4-1-2-3, I suppose, uh, it's got a DM, obviously that's Schneidlin, we've got Schweinsteiger and Herrera just ahead of those, I was debating playing Fellini, because he has been really good recently, but I think that trio will do the job a bit better against Manchester City, we've got Matter on the left, because he's been doing quite well as that, even in that job role that he's got, Young on the right, who's been very good there as well, and Rooney up top, we've got a lot of quality on the bench, we can bring on Memphis, Martial, Fellini, I know he's not quality in real life, but on this game, is fairly good, he's a, he's a decent option to have, to be honest, and yeah, we really, really need to win this, so come on lads, yes, I've motivated them, that's good to see, hopefully we can reward that with a win. Well, that was a shit first half. There was no highlights whatsoever. Right, I've changed the formation. I've brought Martial on for Schweinsteiger, so we've got two up top now. 
hopefully that can spark something we're also going to go attacking i'm going to change some of the instructions here i'm gonna i'm gonna risk it run from positions be more expressive run at defense right come on lads come on that's oh yes yes under herrera one nil get in all right maybe i'll undo all the shit that i've done just in case oh shit they've got a highlight directly after no please Please don't do this. I've literally just changed things. But it might be our highlight. Go on, Rooney. Yes! Wayne Rooney, two in two minutes. Get in. Right. You know what? We're, we're, we're definitely... I'm going to pause that. I'm going to change things now. 2-0. We don't need to do any of this shit. We'll retain possession. Um, and we're, we're just going to go standardise. If it will let me. I don't want to go too defensive. Because that usually uh, doesn't work for me for some reason. So we're going to... We're going to go counter, actually. We've got another chance here, though. It's Young. Out to show. Back to Young. That should be 3-0, but it's not. And uh, I'm not bothered as long as we walk out with a solid victory against Manchester City. That'll that'll make me happy. That'll do me. Come on. Right, I'm subbing off Wayne Rooney and Chris Smalling. Letting them get a bit more, you know, of a rest, I suppose. They've played 80 minutes. They've done very well. And... Uh, that should be game over. That should be the first win, well, big win we've had, I suppose. And it's against Manchester City. And that might even put us into the top four. I'm not sure, but we're close. We're fifth. We're two points off top four. So this episode's been really, really good. It started off absolutely shite going out the Capital One Cup. But we've won everything upon, uh, apart from that. Right, so in recap of this episode, obviously it started off with a defeat in the Capital One Cup, but then we followed it up with three successive Premier League victories, as well as a massive 6-3 victory against PSB in the Champions League. So, in terms of the Champions League, we are top on two games played. It wasn't the first game, what the hell am I going on about? I forgot we beat Sevilla as well. So, we're actually looking really, really good to win that group. We've got Wolfsburg now. If we beat them, I think... Well, we'll have qualified, but, uh, you know, one more win after that and we'll have won the group, which is terrific. So that is the next game. We've got Liverpool shortly after that. But in terms of the league, we're catching up. Our goal difference can and will improve, but we're two points off fourth and we're seven points off the lead. So, you know, it's been a good episode. I'm very happy with it. And uh, as I say, next episode, we start off with Wolfsburg, then Liverpool, Sunderland, Wolfsburg again, and Aston Villa. So it should hopefully be a fantastic episode obviously Liverpool being the key game there and we also could secure well should secure Champions League qualification so things are looking up and then January window isn't too far away after that so hopefully I've enjoyed drop any suggestions for transfers or how you want the series to go hopefully I've enjoyed subscribe if you haven't already and yeah peace